Hey everybody, Tech Clark here from scubaguru.com and I am delighted to introduce to you this new vlog, a video blog, and it is called Beyond the Standard. <laughs> What does Beyond the Standard mean? Well, it's the motto of scubaguru.com, and that is because scubaguru.com and this vlog are dedicated to the dive professional, or somebody that aspires to be a dive professional. Now, what you're going to find in this vlog is anything that is going to enrich you as a dive leader or a dive pro. This is going to be rich in content that encourages you to go beyond the standard. And that standard could be how you teach, how you lead dives, how you give customer service on a dive boat in a dive shop, what your interaction is like with uh, people, students, divers. Hey, there's going to be things about your own personal development and growth. So for this first episode, let's talk about going beyond the standard. What does that mean? What we're talking about here is that in diving, we have tons of standards and procedures that we must follow, whether to teach scuba classes, or whether to take people diving. When there's supervision involved, we have this duty to care for the people that are in our charge. And so with that duty comes a standard of care that we have to follow. And so that standard of care that we follow comes with different agency standards, with RSTC minimums, and then each agency adds to that. Well, the thing is, what does it look like if we just follow the minimum standards? If we just follow the minimum standards, there may be effectiveness there, but are we really engaging in richness and fullness to the level that there could be? Now, I'm not talking about giving a college level course for your open water diver course, but what I am talking about is what would it be like if you put time, attention, detail into the finer things that went on in a scuba class. What happens if we did more skill repeats and skill variations and we really engage the student more with more contact hours? You see, all of this changes the dynamic of the relationship between the dive professional and the diver or the customer or the student, whatever that is. So when we take a look at what it means to go beyond the standard, think of this. What can you do more of? What can you be better at that would be more fulfilling to the divers that you serve? Now, this doesn't just happen with dive training or on a dive trip. This can be all about customer service. This can be your leadership attributes. How are you as a communicator? How are you as a leader? How are you with customer service? You see, there are standards that we read about with all those things too. But what would it look like if you went beyond that standard and you engaged customers deeply when they came into your dive center? Or you engaged customers on a whole different level when they're on your dive boat. So when we look at going beyond the standard, it can be little things, little tips, techniques that will manifest. And I will take something that is an area and we will focus on that as we move forward in this vlog. But think about that. Think about what it means to go beyond the standard. And I look forward to delivering you content every week that enriches you and serves you and allows you to be a really great dive professional. So that's what this vlog is gonna be all about and it's gonna come out to you every Friday, so be on the lookout for it. Subscribe here on the YouTube channel and you will get it every Friday. So I'm super excited about this and I thank you for watching and thank you for being a part of this. So again, if you are a dive professional or you are an aspiring dive professional, this vlog is for you. So until next time, thank you so much, and remember, go beyond the standard.